we've got a reader question for you guys today and it comes from Faith. Faith says, my dog seemed to have forgotten everything this week. She's due to have her anal glands expressed and I realize that her behavior deteriorates just before it's gland time. Could there be a correlation? I tried researching this and I didn't find any answers. Well, Faith, you came to the right place because I have some answers for you. Yes, yeah. there could absolutely be a correlation. Dogs can associate any two events. Your dog could be associating how uncomfortable it feels to have full anal sacs with being taken to have her anal sacs expressed. And once she begins to anticipate that that will happen, right? So as she feels the discomfort kind of coming on over that week, she can become really anxious and get worried about what is going to happen next. Here's the key. The anal gland expression needs to be more fun. That doesn't sound like something you could do, but you really can do it. You can use food at the veterinarians or the groomers, wherever you go, to distract your dog so that it's a happier event, like a less stressful event. You can talk to your vet about options to keep your dog's anal sacs from getting full. Often these dogs actually have dermatologic disease like allergies, right? Or they might have GI disease like diarrhea or constipation that will contribute to some of these anal gland problems. The next thing you can do is you can teach your dog to accept having her anal glands expressed with this thing called cooperative care. It is mega cool where you teach your dog to offer behaviors that will help her to be calm during her own medical care. So yes, you are right, Faith, you know your dog and Yes, there are lots of things you can do to help her not hate having her anal glands expressed.